Welcome back to Let's Play No One Lives Forever. I'm Burning Dog Face, and uh, a few of you couldn't hear the high-pitched tone I was talking about when I was talking about this setting on my headset, so I thought I would do this intro without any background music to obscure it. That being said, I thought I would give this setting a shot for uh, this session anyway, so let's get back to the training room. There we are. Yeah, there wasn't really a consensus on, uh, the two settings I discussed for the headset. Some people liked the first setting, some people liked the second one. I don't know why I tried that, there's clearly nothing over here. So advanced training, let me guess. Uh, from this point on, guards are psychic and they will detect me if I think the word spy. perfume that'll really knock them out. Literally. It sprays a cloud of vapor that contains a potent sedative capable of knocking out a horse, let alone an adult human. Just be careful not to wander into the cloud yourself, or who knows where, or even if, you'll wake up. Why don't you try it out on Leon here? He's been up for 32 hours straight working on a new prototype. The rest might do him some good. Hmm. I like that Leon didn't seem to notice that. That wasn't what I was expecting to happen. I thought it was going to be a gas grenade. That's why I was standing so far back. I'm glad it still worked. Well. Briefcase rocket launcher. Hmm. Oh. Sorry, Leon. I swear to God, I didn't push E. Excellent. Proceed to Hamburg, West Germany, and rendezvous with Thomas Goodman, an operative from Unity's American branch. Goodman may have information concerning Dr. Schenker's whereabouts. The rendezvous will take place at Das Einsame Valkyrie, a popular beatnik nightclub in Hamburg. You will recognize Agent Goodman by his rugged good looks and the unlit cigarette he is holding in his left hand. Offer him a light. He will answer with, sorry, but I don't smoke. Once you have made contact, you will be under Agent Goodman's command. Follow his orders implicitly. That is a strange key word for uh, a guy holding a cigarette, but okay. Ah, oh, damn it. I need the cigarette lighter. If I don't have... Well, they, the other mission, they specified a cigarette lighter, and they said if you can't find a piece of equipment, it's probably around somewhere. So I'm going to err on the side of being an idiot. I don't know about this. Uh, I looked into it, by the way. That one room with the guard in the little guardhouse with the camera pointing directly at him. In order to be stealthy, what you're supposed to do there is to throw a coin and lure him out of the building so that the camera can't see him when you knock him out. I don't know what you're supposed to do to, uh, you know, get to the switch without being detected, but... Apparently not having the coin basically crippled my, uh, stealth abilities. That being said, I'm kind of not in love with the stealth in this game to begin with. I don't know. Hmm, maybe I just will take the lighter with me. I need the sunglasses for intel. That's actually really handy. Fine, let's go with that. Yes, I don't know. Is it just like a passive thing? Is that what that is? Oh, no weapons at all. Fuck. I guess West Germany gives more of a shit than East Germany if you're armed. 
Hmm. How am I going to get in there? I demand to be let in. I'm sorry. That's impossible. But my girlfriend is inside. I understand that, but I can't let you in. Can I at least go find her? Sadly, no. Why not? Because the club is full. Nobody else is allowed. Well, can you go find her for me? I must stay here. Then can you send someone to find her? Everyone is busy. You will just have to wait. I want to speak to someone in charge. As I said, everyone is busy. If you come back tomorrow after 10 a.m., perhaps you can speak with someone then. But my girlfriend is in there now. Perhaps you should have come together. Then you would not be in this situation, and I would not have to listen to you shouting at me. I'm just getting warmed up. It's not my fault that you're out here and she is in there. It is your fault. She is your girlfriend. You should have known better than to ask her to wait for you inside a club that is known to fill up every single night. Can I please just go and find her? I said no, and I meant it. Now go away or I will call the police. Schweinhund. Scheiß cough. Is it always as crowded? Yeah. The place fills up every night. People come for the music. Do you think they'll let us in? I doubt it. I have to get in there. Really? Well, let me help you. I'll distract the bouncer so you can climb in through that window. Watch out for the camera, though. Thanks. My pleasure. Have fun. Hey, baby. Wanna dance? Awkward. Hello, big boy. Well, hello there. It sure is crowded tonight. It's I've been waiting out here for 20 minutes. I hope the performance is good. You must meet a lot of pretty girls. I'm always yes, too late to get in. Do I meet enchanting ones. You tease. Leave me alone. I do not tease. What? What? Schweinhund. Scheiß Kopf. So the fact that he sees me at all blows my cover. This fucking game, man. Schweinhund. Scheiß Kopf. Quick save. Is it always... crowded tonight? It usually is. This place is very popular. You must meet a lot oh. of pretty girls. Yes, but rarely do I meet enchanting ones. You're teasing. I do not tease. Promises, promises. I get off in an hour. Then so do I. Your place or mine? Let's start at your... <laughs> What? You will excuse me. This is all I have time for this evening. Thank you, thank you. Perhaps I will sing for you later. What is so important you need to interrupt me in the middle of a performance? You know how these people treasure my concerts. Now they will lament. Das tut mir leid, Fräulein Wagner. Of course, if they are sad, they will buy more drinks to drown their sorrows, which is good for business. But it troubles me to know that someone is unhappy because I was unable to give enough of myself. A gift like mine comes with terrible responsibility, you know. Yeah, and you have so much of yourself to give. Even such pathetic, horrible creatures as these smelly beatniks deserve some sympathy, yeah? Now then, perhaps you will care to remind me why I am talking instead of singing. Fräulein Wagner, the super spy is here. What should we do? So, the 
fly has rung the doorbell of the spider. You did the right thing. Let her have a few drinks. Then she goes to the water closet, grab her and bring her to me. Am I understood? Jawohl. Good. Watch her closely. She is not to leave under any circumstances. It will be done as you have asked. If you succeed, perhaps I will be convinced to sing for you. Would you like that? Very much so, Fräulein Wagner. It would be a great honor. Then make me happy. When I am happy, I sing like a night and gale in springtime. All right, fuck this place. What's in a lab coat? Serious question. All right, let's get this nonsense over with. Oh, I can't close that. I love your outfit. I do too. Can I talk you out of it? <laughs> These cramps are killing me. Oh dear. Sorry to hear that. Oh, I thought that was Intel. It's just a purse. Gotta make sure not to accidentally wander into the bathroom. This is a very 60s club. Leave me alone! Why the hell did you come to a club, then? Like, serious question. I thought the music was terrible. How can you say that? It's unconventional, certainly, but that's what makes it so compelling. It's not compelling, it's just bad. Well, what do you know about music anyway? Maybe it's just too sophisticated for my taste. Personally, I like music that has a melody. How passe. Anyone can sing a melody, but it takes a true artist to defy a melody, especially with such passion and courage. Where are you going? Somewhere else. Oh. Why is there a goddamn shark out there? Better to sit here long enough, is the shark going to show up and then do an about face too? Oh no, he already did that. I mean, that's kind of cool. I mean, the surface of the water doesn't look great, but again, 2000, so I'll allow it. This club is super groovy, don't you think so? I think putting in the stealth music here kind of ruins the mood, but... I do like the decor. Well then, uh, since I don't know what's in there... How's he coming from that direction? No. Even in 2000, that would at least be animated if it was meant to be water. There must be something up here. Huh? Uh... Does this thing have a zoom on it? Yes. PJ Time Productions. And I can't read the rest of it, because it's a very low-quality, uh... Texture is the word I'm thinking of. A lot of Kiwi Teenies is lying around. At least I'm assuming that's why it's bright green. I wonder where my boyfriend is. He asked me to meet him here. 
Thanks, Kate. I think your boyfriend is ah. waiting outside. Really? Thank you. Here, I found this sitting on the table. In concert this Tuesday, Fraulein Wagner and the Valkyries. So is Harm just made up of, uh... A bunch of weird cultural stereotypes, or what? What am I actually- oh, alright, looking for the guy with the smoke in his hands. Oh. Armor, an intel item. Yoink! Goodman's not here yet. Find the manager's office and poke around for useful information. Oops! Uh, how am I doing this again? Yes, that's right. Employee alert, I have to lean forward because it's in tiny letters now. Please refrain from dumping beer into the canal behind Das Einsame Valkyrie. We've received three citations already this month. The fish are getting loaded on company time, and we can't have that. What is that voice saying? I can't make anything out, for the love of... Ah! Okay, okay. It's Perspex glass, it's not, um... Oh. Oh yeah, that'd be the guy. So I'll just save, and then go take a peek down here. I don't read a word of German. I mentioned that before, didn't I? See, that I can figure out. A lot of unattended drinks. Was the 60s and more innocent time, really? The show ended early tonight. I hope there's another set later. I'm pretty sure that's the same voice actress that Kate has, but I'll allow that. That's because the production values are actually pretty good otherwise. Alright. Would you care for a light? I guess I didn't need Thanks, the Thanks, but I don't smoke. You're holding a cigarette. Am I? Well, what do you know? I guess old habits die hard. Say, can I borrow a dime? I want to call my mom and tell her I just met the girl of my dreams. I gave my last dime to a worthwhile charity. Ouch. I wasn't expecting a woman. You weren't briefed. They just said meet Agent Archer at 8 p.m. Well, I'm Agent Archer. So I gathered. Didn't the code phrase tip you off? I thought it was a little unusual, but I figured, hey, it's Europe. Things are different over here. <laughs> Scotch and soda. Will you have a drink? Old Grandad, bring the bottle, a tumbler, and a bowl of ice. Goodness, are you celebrating? Compensating, actually. How sad for you. So tell me, Ms. Archer. Oh, now don't start with that. What? There's no need to patronize me. Was I patronizing you? Yes, you were. Well, I'm sorry, but I didn't realize I was going to have to babysit on this assignment. I may be a woman, but that doesn't mean I can't take care of myself. Oh, I get it. You're one of those women's livers. Dress up in men's clothing, ride motorcycles, smoke cigars, that kind of thing. 
Just because I can take care of myself doesn't mean I'm not a woman. They're not mutually exclusive, you know. But isn't the point of women's liberation to allow young ladies like yourself to become men? The point is to allow young ladies to become whatever they please. Ouch. Well, if you're as deadly with a pistol as you are with your tongue, you can watch both our backs. All right, I will. So what's the plan? Well, the first thing is to find out who the goon is. Excuse me? You're being watched. If you can lure him someplace quiet, I'll jump him and find out what he's after. That's very noble of you, but I think I can handle that little fellow. Suit yourself. Where should I ambush him? Try the ladies' room. What? You think he'll follow me into the loo? Heck yeah, look at him. He's concentrating so hard on not being noticed, he'd probably follow you into heavy traffic without a second thought. Anyway, you'll certainly be justified interrogating him, won't you? I'd be justified in doing worse than that. Just make sure you question him first. I'll be waiting by the stage. Be wary of the operetta. It's a bit enthusiastic. I can take it. Ow! That's not good. Damn it. Okay, it does default to the uh, the lockpicks when I uh, just pull the thing out through the holster button. Well, the timer went, so... I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you on the next episode of Let's Play No One Lives Forever, when we lure this guy into the bathroom and then give him the beating he deserves. Later. <laughs>